Here is a quick tutorial for home screen widgets on Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. So, if you want to add a new widget, what you need to do is press and hold your finger on an empty space in the home screen. Once we are in the edit mode, we can press this widgets button over here. And now we will find some example widgets that we can add, or we can scroll down in order to find the list of apps that have widgets. So, let's say I'm going to go to Spotify and I can add this one. I can tap on the widget and press add in order to add it to the home screen, or you can also press and hold your finger on the widget and then drag and drop it anywhere. Now, if you want to remove a widget, you want to press and hold your finger on the widget and then you find the remove option over here. And just like that, we can remove widgets. There is also one more thing that you can do. So if we go to widgets and if we use a widget, so let's say I'm gonna choose this Chrome shortcut here, and I'm gonna add it over here to the top. Now I can, sometimes I can also adjust the size of the widget. So if you press and hold your finger again, uh, if the widget can be adjusted, you will see that it has these corners. We can grab those corners and we can resize, sometimes we can resize the widget. So as you can see, I can make it a little bit bigger. If I try to make it smaller, in this case, I cannot, but sometimes you actually can, so keep that in mind. Besides that, we also have an option that is called create a stack. So we can make a single spot, let's call it this whole space a spot, for multiple different widgets. So if we go to create stack, here we can choose another widget that will be sharing the same place. And what is important is that the size of that widget must be the same as the one that is already here. So that widget that I added is four by one, meaning it contains or it occupies four spots um, when we are looking at the width and one space if we are looking at the height. So for example, if I go to Spotify, here's another example of the same size for a widget. So now I can select this widget and I'm gonna press add. And now I can swipe left and right in order to switch between those widgets. After a few seconds, that um, that uh, outline is gone. But as, a, as you can see, I can create multiple widgets and I can keep swi swiping over here so I have access to multiple widgets in the same spot. If you press and hold your finger now on that uh, widget, you will see that I can remove all widgets at once that are in the stack or I can press edit stack and here I can either remove the widget, the one that I have here, or I can go to the far right side and I can add another one. So let's see if we can find anything else. So let's say contacts, we're gonna add it here. And there we go. So this is how we can access multiple widgets at once. And that is pretty much it. Keep in mind that you can also reposition those widgets. So if you press and hold your finger on the widget or the stack of widgets, you can still move them around anywhere you wish them to be, as long as there is enough space for them. And of course, you can also make a spot for them if needed, like this. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.